Okay, so in this video, I wanted to run through the benefits of having a website for a small business. Now, when I say small business here, I'm including micro businesses, you know, hobby businesses, any small business that thinks, hey, I don't really need a website because you do. Okay, so why? What are the, what are the benefits of having a website for your small business? So the first one is 24 seven accessibility. You are not always at your business, at your desk, at your phone. Don't always have the doors open at the business. You have to sleep, you have to eat. And most people got into being a business owner because they wanted to have more of something, whether that was more time with their family, more time on holidays, things like that. So having a website allows your business to be open 24 seven without you having to be there driving it 24 seven. Second one is a form of cost-effective marketing. Websites, yes, you can build them yourself, but if you were going to, I would highly recommend paying a professional to do it. Watch any of the other videos on my channel where we talk about website design and you'll see just the benefits of getting a professional design done. Sure, there's an upfront cost, and when it comes to the price of a website, how long's a piece of string? It depends on what it is you need on your website. But a website is a cost-effective form of marketing for your business because we can implement things like SEO strategies, we can do small business, you know, target audiences and and external marketing that all benefits by having a website for people to come back to to gather the final bit of information that they need. It also allows us to collect analytics on who are visiting your website. What are they looking at? What what are they coming to you for? Because what you, you may think is the reason people visit you may not actually be the reason at all. And the content that you may think is the most popular could be completely not what people are looking at. Okay, so the third item is credibility and professionalism. Generally, people will do research about a product or a service before they buy. And that research can be asking other people who may have used you, reading reviews online, or checking out your website to find out, you know, what other people think of you where you've displayed your reviews, find out what your services are about, check your qualifications to sell that service, especially if you're in the healthcare space or the finance space. Okay, and a website gives you a wider audience reach. Because a website is there 24 seven, it means that it can be displayed 24 seven globally. So if you're selling a product that's unique and you're prepared to sell that product to the world, then a website gives you a platform to do that. Where if you are a business owner who only has a brick and mortar store, people from the other side of the world can't come and buy your product, no matter how good it is, no matter how unique it is. So a website can help you reach a wider audience. Now the fifth item is customer insights. The more information we have about our customers and how they interact with our business and our product and things like that, the better educated we become when it comes to making a decision for your business moving forward. When it comes to things like research and development as to what the next best thing that you could release as a product is. These all come from customer insights, which you can gain through your website, using tools like Google Analytics, heat mapping through platforms like Hotjar, um, analytics through your CRM software. Every piece of information gives you better clarity around everything to do with your business.
The next one is enhanced customer service. So a website can improve your customer service by providing easy access to information, online support, easy to contact using contact forms, and this convenience alone improves customer satisfaction and can lead to higher retention rates when it comes to your customer. Competitive advantage. So having a website can give your small business a competitive edge because a well-designed website showcasing your unique selling points, your unique products, your unique services, what makes you different, it positions your business against competitors and can capture a larger share of the market. Especially if you're in a micro space where there's nobody else potentially doing exactly what you do or doing it exactly how you do it. So it's always worth making sure you've got a website to help gain that competitive advantage. E-commerce. Having a website allows you to sell your products online. Whether you're selling to your local area, selling to the state you live in, selling to the country you live in, or selling globally or internationally. Your website can be tailored to have e-commerce functionality that helps you sell things 24 seven. Imagine what it would be if you, say you made $1,000 a day just selling one particular product in store for the eight hours a day that you're open. Imagine what adding the rest of the day, the night, to be open 24 seven and sell products. Imagine what that can do for your business growth. Now the next one is brand development. Having a website helps create a lasting impression that aligns with your brand and it helps to showcase your values and the mission of your business. We always recommend making sure that you have a clearly defined value set of values and mission for your business. And it's one of those things that maybe you want to sit down and talk with a brand strategist or a marketing strategist to help you get clear because the clearer your values, your mission, your brand, all those things are, the easier your target market are going to identify with you and the easier it's going to be for you to tailor your products and services to the market that you're actually targeting. And the final one is scalability. Having a website means as your business grows, so can your website, so can your market, and you have the ability to basically grow your business to levels that you've never thought of simply by having the systems in place via your website to help you grow. So a website is not just a luxury for small businesses. It's a necessity in today's marketplace. It offers a multitude of benefits from increasing your visibility and credibility to expanding market reach, providing valuable customer insights. So investing in a professional website is investing in your business's future growth and success. So if I could suggest for you some next steps. First one, evaluate your needs. Determine what it is you want your website to achieve for your business. Sit down and do some research and planning. So look into website platforms and design options or consider hiring a professional web designer. Develop some content. Start creating content that reflects your brand and meets your audience's needs. Launch and promote. So once your website's live, promote it through your social media, do some SEO, any other marketing channels you can think of that are relevant. If you're in industry specific business, maybe there are industry specific bodies you can reach out to to market and advertise through. And then finally, analyze and improve. Use website analytics to continuously improve your site based on user feedback and behaviors. As I said before, the best way to go about this would be to sit down, contact a brand strategist, contact a marketing strategist, pay for whatever their smallest program is to sit down and get some clarity 
for your business. Whether you're going to do a DIY website or build it yourself, you know, build it yourself or pay a professional, having that knowledge before you walk through the door and go through this process is going to help you immensely. So I hope you got something out of this video and I really think that, you know, with work, you're going to get a lot further with your business and a lot further with your market share by having a professionally designed website regardless of the size of your business. So until the next video, this is Martin from Define Marketing, signing off.